and today we have another like car vlog, I guess. I don't know. Oh, this thing keeps, I don't know what it's doing. Did this last time. I am on my way to the post office to drop off my giveaway winners. I had two of them on my main channel. I just got done filming my Beautylish Lucky Bag. I know. I still haven't took that stupid sound off. Like, it sounds like a race car. I got to figure out how to do it. Um, and I wasn't expecting it today, my Beautylish Lucky Bag. I got the XL one today because I, I was supposed to get it yesterday, but it was still in Chicago. When I checked it this morning, it was in Pennsylvania. So I'm like, it's not going to come today. So this is normally how I look when I'm not, not filming. I'm into back to that 90s feel where you don't really have makeup on. It's the lip liner with the brownish color lipstick, the name earrings. The only difference is back in the 90s, um, I had fake nails all the time. And I'm like 30 minutes away from Atlantic City. So I used to go get them done there and have them like airbrushed, you know, all that stuff. Um, now, when I was in high school, I did wear foundation and stuff, but it was like, <laughs> everybody looked orange. It was the, oh, there's no parking space. It was the powdered foundation that I used. And remember, everything was beige. And it was like an orange look. And you put it on, it had like the thing, you know, the puff thingy. And, um, you know, you didn't know because there was no social media, right? There was no like YouTube. Uh, there was no like TV, like where they taught you how to do makeup. You know, it was none of that stuff. You went to school for it, you know, to learn. And uh, so we didn't know about blending. So guess what, guys? right here would cut it off so we looked all you could tell we had makeup on there was no like there was bronzer but i didn't know what contour was there was no highlighter so but basically it was just blush i don't even think i used bronzer it was a hot mess so i did my makeup a little bit different in high school <laughs> and i think i'm going to make a video on my main channel how i used to do my makeup like because i used all drugstore there wasn't sephora or ulta or anything like that you know so i would go to like rite aid there wasn't even walmart's back then when I was in high school, um, at least around my area. So I went to like Rite Aid and, you know, CVS, stuff like that. So I use like CoverGirl, Revlon, Maybelline. So I'll see if they have that stuff. Um, but then when I got to be like 18, 19, 20, like around 94, 95, I didn't wear makeup and I never did my eyebrows. Like today I have a little eyebrow pencil on. You might see my eyebrows look a little different because I'm testing out like what shape I like. But because again, I told you I didn't know I was going to film today. And so I would just wear like, uh, you know, like mascara and lipstick and that's it like no lip gloss anything and I feel weird not having lip gloss on I don't like that feeling anymore but I always had like gold uh remember I was a silver person I still like silver but I always had name earrings I had the name necklaces I had do you remember the letter um ring so I had an A I always had jewelry on but I thought I was big shit back then it's so funny but anyway this is what I normally look like like if I'm not going anywhere you know all right so let me go in there and pay for these giveaways to get sent off and I'll show you I don't want to show you the name whatever but these are what they look like and it's filled up to the top and they're heavy and they're, so there's two of them I still need to do a giveaway for this channel I never have so um, I think I'm going to do more like a, a money giveaway, like a gift card or something like that. I don't know. Anyway, let me go inside, pay for this, and we'll come back and talk. Because I haven't filmed for a while. All right, so I'll be back. All right, I always go in, you know what I mean? Like into the post office, but now that I have a car, I never show you guys like me walking. I love my post office. Rude. Um, because I love like the old school feeling, you know. So I just dropped those packages off. I don't have my selfie stick, so that's why it's shaking. And uh, it was actually cheaper than what I thought. It was just about fifty dollars to send. So, hence why I only had two winners this time. It was just like a thank you giveaway, you know, for all your support and stuff like that. 
All right, let me get my fat ass in the car. I am so mad. I have literally been talking for at least 10 minutes, went to Wendy's and everything for Isaiah, talking, and I never hit record. Oh my goodness. I literally like filmed because I think the last thing I filmed, I hope I, I won't know till I edit it, was me walking out to the car and then I put the phone back on the mount and filmed me driving all the way to Wendy's and saying how every time I say I don't eat out, but it's weird because like today I got up around eight o'clock well, a little bit earlier than that, but I ate breakfast um, around 8 o'clock. And it's 3.08 right now. I have not filmed. I mean, I have not ate anything since then, so I'm hungry. And because I'm ripping and run running, you know, me being diabetic, my sugar drops. So it's like, all right, I need to get something. And yes, Isaiah still, I got to figure it out. He's got to tell me how to take this stupid thing off where it sounds like a racehorse. I hate it. So anyway, I got him the number six. That's what I was saying. He likes the spicy chicken meal with everything on it. When I get it, I like the number six with just cheese and lettuce and um, like I don't get no mayonnaise, anything on it. All right, so I'm going to Burger King. They used to have, oh, Adventures of Escaping. Your challenge. I didn't know they have an escape thing. I've never been there. I need to go there. They used to have um, a gym here, but I think they moved it because I don't see it now. What is this now? That's what I want to look. Oh, NYC Fitness. This is something different. That's the radar detector going off. Tell me that there's alarms. Um... Because I want to start going to the gym. I've got to lose my stomach. I, I have that uh, insulin resistance. And so, I mean, sometimes I look like I'm pregnant. Like five, six months pregnant. And people say, oh, how far along are you? And that's when the fat is on the inside. And it, it's hard to lose. It's then, you know, like when I sit, I don't have any rolls. You know, it just, I don't know. It's hard to explain. And this ain't helping me. I cannot believe I was not recording. Okay. Hi, and welcome to Burger King. Where are what you going? Would well, you like to try a Whopper meal today? Uh, can I have a number five, please? Um, with just cheese and lettuce, no mayonnaise or anything? Number five with cheese and lettuce, uh, plain, like no mayonnaise or ketchup or anything. Um, and then an order of your nuggets. Just, what's that? Uh, what's a four piece? And that's it. Thank you. So that came to 9.37. So two meals. 10.33 was his. Mine was not. Oh my God. It's like 18 bucks. Right? 20 bucks. I don't know if I'm supposed to go to this window or the second one. Oh. I was just getting ready to pull up. I, I was like, I don't think nobody's there at that window. No, thank you. Thank you. this out but why do they have it on this side where you okay I'm gonna have to do a Yui here Lexi was using this car the other day and look she left this in there should have done is had my selfie stick and went to the lake and then just ate and talked to you guys so we're just going to 
pull over right here and eat and chat. Since I haven't put a video up in a while, I just want to let you guys know I'm okay. I had a couple of people reach out to me on Instagram. I'm like, are you okay? Because I think I put like I was going to go to the mall, but I didn't get a chance to go. There's my hand sanitizer. All right. The car is off. So let me know what you guys been up to. So I've seen some stuff on YouTube, like, I'm kind of glad. I was debating whether or not to talk about it. Here are the nuggets. So you guys know, like, what, nine, nine months ago, 10 months ago? I don't know how long it's been. How long, let me say. Yeah, like 10 months ago, almost a year ago, there was a public beef that went on with me and Abby, which me and Abby were fine. I mean, we're not like where we were, but you know, we talked stuff like that. And um you guys know that um somebody had made a live stream and like accused me of something that I didn't do. And for the longest time I couldn't let it go when I brought it to YouTube, which I should not have, you know, I mean that was my fault. Well, I always tell you guys, and sometimes I need to practice what I preach. The truth always comes out. Light wins over dark. Now, sometimes it takes a little bit. Sometimes it takes a year. Sometimes it takes a couple weeks. Sometimes it takes five years. But the truth always comes out. And um, Not Another Housewife made a video, which I'm going to link her video down below, talking about this particular person. And... Um, just about the stuff that like she did to them. And then you can see what I dealt with, you know, about with being accused and the lies and different things like that. Now I will say this person actually took her lives, the lives down, which I'm very thankful for. I'm glad. And I mean, I'm most, a lot of people already seen it. If you don't know what I'm talking about, you don't know, but it was just very disgusting, gross. And I always say when friends two friends are fighting it's okay to let to listen to somebody vent or give your opinion or whatever but you should not ever get involved where you're going public and taking sides because especially if it's more than a youtube friendship it's kind of like a marriage or like somebody that's in a relationship right like your friend will tell you what's going on but sometimes then you, you'll take their side and you're mad at the other party and then they make up and then you look like a fool because now the other person's still mad with you. You're mad. Like, do you understand what I'm saying? And so I always, like for me, I never get into a friend's beefing. I'll be here to listen. I'll give my opinion. But that's as far as I'll go. I'll never take it to YouTube and give my opinion. You know, you know what I'm saying, right? I always say too, you know my saying when I say, just because somebody says it doesn't make it true, right? Because a lot of times, when people watched her lie, people believe these things about me. They believed and unsubscribed. Some of them I haven't even heard from, and it hurt my feelings, you know? Now, I have nothing against this person. You know, we kind of like squashed it. It's over. The live streams are down. I'm not going to bring her name up. or talk. I'm only talking about this because I want to share this video because I know some of you guys have reached out to me. you already seen it, so... And I'm just going to share it with you guys, and then you guys can make your own opinion. And hence why you shouldn't always believe everything you hear, right? Unless there's receipts. Because in my defense, when these live streams were being made or videos, there were no receipts made. There was no proof of anything. It was just hearsay talk. I just realized that I filmed my video today. My Be Leaders Lucky Bag with not my partial. I don't even have my partial one now. Oh my goodness, I'm so used to... Well, what it is is when I first put it on, you know, when I came from the dentist and then I had this tooth fixed, so I was still numb and I didn't feel it didn't hurt. But now, like, the inside, when I put it on the inside of my mouth, it hurts. It kind of, like, makes a scratch. It's sore. So I have to go back and get them to fix that. So I only put it on like if I'm going out or making a video or something like that. Just at home, I don't because it's uncomfortable right now. But I paid too much money to not wear the that mug. You know? All right, I'm going to get off of here. I'm going to go home and eat. This is a ver. I don't even know if this video is going to be 10 minutes long. I just wanted to come on here and say that I'm okay. I know I haven't been filming. 
but I've been working on, I'm, I have my own brand coming and I've been really working on things behind the scenes, which takes a lot of time. And then when my husband gets off of work or my kids are home, you know, I try to spend time with them and then I film on my main channel, but I cannot wait to share some stuff with you. I really can't. And uh, yeah, so I'm going to be doing a car vlog tomorrow, this week, and I'm going to do start doing my walk and talks with the puppy. I made a shorts, which I'll leave it down below. I'll be trying to put it with the leash with the puppy. She does have a harness too, but I was just trying to test it out because the harness, she won't move. So I tried to test it out. Will she move with the leash? She will not. I cannot handle Nala and her yet because I have the carpal tunnel. So um, what we're doing, me and my son, to oldest son, Tyler, he, I walk, he walks Nala and I have the puppy to teach her what the leash is and walking. And so I'm going to start taking the puppy to the trails that I go to because I can't handle both. And God forbid there's another dog or something like that. I just can't. With holding the selfie stick with recording. But let me know down below, would you guys be interested if I start taking the puppy and, um, you know, seeing how the puppy reacts. And, yeah, so that's what my plans are. Um, I, I'm going to Atlantic City. I believe it's Sunday I'm going. So I'll definitely record that. And if I'm there at night, I'll record, like, the lights and the casinos and stuff. But I plan on going to one of the casinos, so I'll, like, film what I can, because you're not really supposed to film in the casino part. So I'll try to film what I can where you can see, because some people never been to a casino, and see what that is. And I only take $50 with me, because let me tell you, I am the type of person, if I have $500 on me, I will spend all of it, because I'm like, all right, one more try, one more try, one more try. So I'll take probably maybe 100 And I usually just play the slots. Um, cause I do it for fun, you know, that way, whatever I lose, I don't care, you know, because there was one time I think I, I, I don't know, I spent maybe a hundred dollars and I won like 800. I put the damn thing all back in because I'm like, oh, maybe I could try again. I go to another machine. Maybe I could try again. That's my issue. I need to know like when I win to walk away, that is my issue. <laughs> so I'm going to do that and film that. So more videos to come. Um, I think what I want to start doing when I go grocery shopping and stuff or like film me cooking my dinner for my family, film, film more things in the house too. So you get to know me on a more of a personal level as well. All right, now I'm just talking and not making any sense. I'm just talking to talk, but I wanted to come on real quick, let you know I'm okay. Videos to come. Like I said, I'll be filming tomorrow and then this weekend, and I have the AC trip coming up, so make sure you have your post notification bell on, that way you will be hopefully notified, because YouTube isn't giving out notifications anymore, all right, so that's it, I'm getting off of here, please like this video, it really does help me out, or dislike it, that helps me out as well, make sure you leave a comment, commenting really does help out, it helps out with engagement, let me know down below, what would you like to see on this channel? I know I asked you guys a lot, but just in case if you're new or whatever, let me know. And that's everything, guys. Stay beautiful, stay blessed, stay healthy, and most importantly, always stay you no matter what. And I will see you in my next video. Bye, guys. I don't even know if I'll put this video up because I basically talked about nothing. No, I didn't. I'm on my way home. Yes, I am. What's on the radio? What is on? Who is messing with my radio? Oh, what is going on? Nothing.